In this video, we're revealing how to make money with high ticket closing and how complete beginners are earning $700 a day with no experience. More with that after the intro. Hey guys, how's it going? Mike Fasil here. Welcome to this video. Before we actually begin, I remind you that several spots have opened up for this week's free workshop, where it's the fastest and easiest way to make money online. Sign up for it in the link below. We literally have a 62 year old woman go from zero to $160,000 in profit in 90 days, so check it out now. This is probably one of the most like important skills that I've ever learned in my entire life, and I figured this out on accident, the skill of high ticket closing and high ticket scales. You know, I literally was like supposed to be a dentist, right? I was going to school, going to college, going to become a dentist, and here I was like thrown into this direct sales company where I literally needed to learn sales, right? I wanted to be, figure out a way to, for example, like help my mom and dad pay off my student loan that pay off my credit card bill and I knew that if I needed to get like money which I did not have I had to get good at sales Zig Ziglar says it the best people that do not know sales raise skinny children and if you don't want your kids or your future kids to be skinny because they have no food on the plate because mommy and daddy can't make any money then learning high ticket scales is a must so let's actually break it down step number one what is high ticket sales so essentially all high ticket sales is you partner with an existing product creator they have a high ticket product it could be two thousand dollars five thousand dollars ten thousand dollars twenty thousand dollars or more and essentially what it is is they do the product delivery they do the customer service they do all of the back-end things and you're really just really dependent on one thing getting on the phone and closing the deal. You know, they give you all the scripts, they tell you what to say, they even train you. But if you could close the sale on the one-on-one -on -one conversation, you could get anywhere from 10% to 20% of the sale. So you can see exactly how big this is, right? Because some of these products, for example, are like five grand. Five grand or 10 grand. If you make one sale from the five grand and it's a 20% commission, you make $1,000 for that one hour phone call but yet you don't have to do any of the backend stuff. You could literally take the money and then leave and you're good to go. You're commission based, you're good to go. But if you really think about it, you know, I have some friends doing high ticket sales. They maybe go on a couple of calls a day. If they close one call a day out of like all of these calls that are already scheduled for them, you know, literally the product creator is handling all the marketing, the advertising and whatnot. If they close one sale a day at five grand for this customer, you're helping them, you're helping the customer make four grand right, in their pocket, they're happily willing and able to give you one grand, because if you think about it, it's a little dance, right? You get on the phone for some of these customers and clients, and you're helping them make five grand deals, five grand deals, they're getting very, very rich. Do you think, if you're making them five grand, that they do this little dance of giving you one grand every time you give them five grand? That's essentially what it is. That is the importance of high ticket sales, and you can do this from anywhere in the world, you can do this in your underwear, you can do this from Cabo, you can do this from Canada, you can do this from anywhere in the world. As long as you know exactly where to find these clients, you could actually get paid literally good money without having to do all the back end stuff by just talking to people that already want to be sold to. Now the second thing you gotta understand is how do you actually make money with high ticket sales? Well number one, you need to first, of course, spend time underneath the bar. What does that actually mean? Well for example, if I wanted to get stronger, I can't read books about it. I'm gonna have to go underneath the squat rack and actually do squats. I can't skip leg day. If I wanna get better at jujitsu, I can't read about it and just watch jujitsu videos all the time. I need to spend time on the mat. And if I wanna get good at sales and I wanna make more money, guess what? I have to get on more conversations on the phone. How did I get good at sales? You know, when I was 18 and 19 years old, I was doing a sales presentation like maybe every other day to people that didn't want to buy things. And after sounding like an idiot for so many different months and years, I started realizing that if I said something and didn't say another thing, certain people would react certain ways. The only way I got good at that was through repetition and time underneath the bar. How did I get at YouTube videos? I literally just started making more videos. Of course, I sound like an idiot in maybe 99.9999999% of it. But the fact is, I'm working on my skill and I'm getting better. You need to spend time underneath the bar when it comes to, you know, for example, sales. And the coolest thing about this, the coolest thing about this, if you learn how to find the right clients, if you learn how to find the right clients, you have an endless stream of people coming in and you can actually learn sales. I mean, I remember when I, for example, took a dating boot camp and I lived in Vegas for 30 days, right? That was crazy. I remember when I was younger, I was afraid of talking to girls because I was like, oh man, if I fail at this one girl that rejects me, you know, Susie from math class in seventh grade, right? And she rejects me, guess what? Now there's only maybe two girls left that I'm attracted to. And I was afraid of failure because I was like, oh, there's only so many people that I could talk to, right? So I would never try. 
But then I went to Vegas and I was like, dude, there's literally thousands of people that come here every single day, every single day. And I started talking to strangers left and right and I started realizing, wow, if I fail, guess what? I never have to see them ever again. Same thing with sales. If you fail on the phone, you don't have to marry the person you're talking to. You never have to see them again. And if you understand that, you're like, wow, if I just get better at talking to people and these people will send me leads and I can learn really like and get paid for it, that's like a no brainer. So how you make money is you just have to get good at the skill. How do you get into the skill? You could either can watch my channel or you can literally take the scripts that they give you because odds are they have a script, they probably have a sales team, they have a sales manager that can train you because they're compensated on how much money you make. Then all you really gotta focus on is number one, be okay with dealing with failure and number two, be willing to put in the reps and number three, have some type of ability to deal with rejection, okay? Because sometimes if they say no once, it's just you gotta deal with the rejection and the objection actually go and turn that into a sale. And if you could get really good at that, you could make more money with high ticket sales. Now the last step is where are you actually going at clients? Well, it's very simple. Where you get clients is two ways, Facebook groups or two, direct outreach. So let's talk about Facebook groups. There are literally so many Facebook groups that you can become a part of for free. Literally, there's marketing groups, there's the click funnels groups, there's you know yoga studio groups, there's literally uh, people that are teaching me a lot to do handstand groups. There's so many different groups. A lot of them are run by someone that has a program, okay? So what you wanna do is you wanna reach out to that person who owns the groups, and you wanna say, hey, I wanna do sales for you for free. Only pay me if I can make a sale for you, right? I wanna work with you, I wanna do something. Do something where you are literally taking work off their plate and where you can make a deal where maybe you could start off at 5% or 10%. But the more sales you can make, you can literally go through a sliding scale where you can maybe make higher, right? One thing that my friend did, here in Bali I interview a bunch of people like this 11 year old girl that turned on $30 million, this guy that makes a million dollars from profit. One of them that I interviewed was my friend who literally went up to fitness coaches and health and wellness coaches and spirituality coaches literally on their Instagram or just meeting them just here in Bali and they're like, hey girl, I wanna do sales for you. Don't worry, you know, I'll do all the hard work for you and if I can make a sale, just give me a percentage. All these people are like, wow, I've been doing the sales myself. And that's what you guys understand, especially here in Bali, this is like the coaching capital of the world. Like some of these people make a lot of good money, but a lot of these people also just make money from their Instagram like organically, not spending any money in the ads, and they get so many DMs of saying, oh girl, please help me with my sexuality. Oh girl, please help me with my weight loss. Oh girl, please help me with, for example, this. And these coaches are also doing their own sales, and they have no idea how to build a business. You can literally slide in their DM, say, hey, I do sales, I'll do sales for you for free. Let me show you exactly what I can do. You literally watch my videos and exactly showing you exactly how to sell and I can even like let you know a script. Just let me know in the comments below if you want another video on that. But if you could make a sale for them, many times it's five grand, 10 grand, 15 grand, their people already want to buy that product. You just gotta get on the phone with them. They would happily, I mean happily give you money. But that's really it guys. If you wanna know an even faster and easier way to make money online, sign up for this week's free workshop. We literally have a 62 year old woman who's actually bad at sales. Went from zero to $160,000 in 90 days with this new method. So check out my podcast of all these successful people that live here in Bali. Check it out right here and right here. See you guys there. Are you?